Good afternoon, it is Saturday today, welcome to a new week. I'm sitting in the garden, it's about 25 degrees today, but very, very cloudy this afternoon, which is typical because I've waited till this afternoon to sit down. This morning I washed the garden furniture, so it's all nice and sparkly. I used the um, elbow grease spray and then rinsed it all off with water from Mrs Hinch recommends elbow grease so it smells divine actually I like the smell of proper cleaning products that might be a bit weird but that's me um, so we just dropped the girls at PQA Mark's running around doing some jobs he's going out to watch the football tonight so it's me and the girls and tomorrow we've got um, a barbecue at my friend's. I'm not sure if I'm going to be allowed to film yet. I'm going to have to ask her permission because she's got two young children. So I'll ask if it's okay for me to film. Um, if not, after that, we're going on to Poppy's Got a Gig. Um, so that should be good. And then it's a new week again. Monday, I'm planning on going swimming. And when I say swimming, I mean probably walking up and down the pool a bit and going in the sauna. But it's still, you know progress. Hello Eve. Have you come out to see mummy? It's nice out here Doos. Oh, okay. No, she's gone to have a drink out of the bird bath. Just wanted to show you, this is an azalea I've got in the back garden. I mean look at that colour. It's an absolute picture. I've just watered all my plants because it's been quite hot today. But they're all coming on nicely. Even the fuchsias that I planted, they're growing nicely as you can see yesterday I got two of these they're just um, mushrooms ceramic or whatever metal this is and then these bits are glow in the dark but last night they didn't really glow so I'm hoping with a full day of sun they might glow tonight but yeah it's all looking really pretty especially that one good afternoon it is yes it's quarter past one it's Monday and I have just been swimming this morning. I went to the doctors first, then I went swimming on my own. I was very proud of myself. I did six lengths and in the pool it's lovely. Yes, my knees hurt. Yes, my legs hurt. Yes, other bits of me hurt. But it was being weightless and just floating and it was lovely. But it was getting out afterwards. Like my legs always go to lead try and have a shower and getting dry and dressed and then home and and now I'm just putting some washing on but yeah I'm a bit tired I'm proud of myself for doing it and I intend to do it every Monday all being well you know what fibro is like by now if you watch my channel so yeah just waiting for Holly to get home She's had a driving lesson and then we're going to have some lunch and watch Sabrina. I don't know if any of you have been watching that, Sabrina, on um, Netflix. We Well, I've watched the first series already, but I'm watching it again with Holly so she can catch up. And then we're going to watch the second series together, which I haven't seen yet. So that's exciting. I don't know if you'll be able to see it and or if it might fly away. But we've got birds in the garden and it was making such a racket that we thought it was the guineas, but it's not. See if I can zoom in on him. I'm going to find out what bird it is. Can you see him? Can you hear that? He's got something in his beak. I don't know if it's stuck to his beak or it's in his beak. What have you got? Hey? I don't quite know what to do about it really. Hopefully he'll sort himself out. Good afternoon, I think it is. I think it's 12. It's, what day is it? Wednesday today. This week feels like it's really dragging. Come on, Eve. This way. Oh, squirrel. Squirrel there, Eve. Squirrel. Squirrel. Did you see it? She saw it. So I just thought I'd take Eve out, which is why I haven't gone to see to yoga, because I can't really do both. And Evie hasn't been out for a couple of days. 
so I thought I'd, I haven't really got any spoons but I thought I'd spend a couple of spoons just on a very short walk um, so that she's at least been out and she loves it so I've got to pick Holly up later from the train station and just do a few jobs really around the house I might do another pebble picture today so I've got some more box frames um, that is if I find some more energy from somewhere weather's a bit miserable today it started off really sunny and now it's really clouded over but I don't know why see if anyone knows but why do they leave all the graves like really long grass why don't they trim those as well I don't know let me know if you know just had to oh she's found another squirrel yep there it goes it's in the tree now it's in the tree Eve it's gone it's gone all gone good girl you got it um I just had a lady very nice lady chat to me but it just made me laugh because I thought do you alter your voice like so if someone talks to you in like a really posh accent do you then try and reply in a posh accent or do you just try and talk in your normal voice I sort of change my accent to suit people which is really weird so I replied in a posh accent <laughs> yeah I know I'm a bit weird <laughs> come on Eve come find some more squiggles should we find more squiggles? That's what I'm starting off with. It's Thursday today. It is 20 past two, just gone. Polly and Carter have gone to the zoo. So I dropped them off this morning because they've got a day off. Um, so they've had a really nice weather day for it. It's just, there's a big black cloud coming over now. So I'm hoping it will hold off for them and Poppy I took to the hospital this morning she had an appointment because she's got to have two of her teeth out before she has her brace fitted so she's having it done under general I think because she's a bit anxious about it after the last one she had taken out was a nightmare no and I said to her you're not going to go through that again so we had that and that was all fine um and then I've been resting. I did take Evie on a very short walk because she needed to go out. But the fibro section I want to do this week is on spoons. So ready? Fibro section. Bling, 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 bling. So, yeah, spoons. Fibromyalgia and spoons. And I'm not talking about a spoon that you eat from. A spoon, if you haven't watched my other vlogs are basically energy for fibro um, sufferers so or anyone really you could say how many spoons have you got I'm just going to balance you on my knee um, so say you wake up in the morning and you think how many spoons of energy have I got today have I got like five have I got ten have I got none and then you gauge from that how many spoons of energy you've got to what how you use them so you can save them like if you haven't got many you think right I can't do a lot today because I haven't got many spoons and I need to save them for what I do need to do so does that make sense um, I hope I'm making sense anyway so I had a doctor's appointment I'm not sure if I've told you that and I sort of broke down in it because I, I just had enough and I'd had a, another fit um, a few a couple of weeks ago or a week ago I think it was one Friday night I had another fit it was during night time and the doctor said that she thinks the fits could be due to the fact that I'm not sleeping so she's increased my medication that I take at night to help me to sleep and for the fibro um, to see if that helps the fits and helps me to sleep. But she said it's going to make you drowsy in the morning, even more so than I am usually for a little while. But bear with it. So I'm like, okay. 
and she said take them early enough in the evening as well so the f that's the door squeaking by the way it's not me it's because the wind's blowing it um so i did take it early enough in the evening i took about six o'clock these tablets the first night i didn't sleep at all and the second and third night i was out like a light but um and I slept all night, but the next day, oh my goodness, talk of spoons, right? I had no spoons. Zero, like, if you could go minus spoons, that was how I was feeling. And still am now. But last night, I only took two tablets instead of three because I knew I had to take Holly and Carter to the zoo and Poppy to hospital. So I took two instead of three. But because it's, that amount is still in my system... I'm still really, really tired. I'm hoping that it's not going to be forever, because if it is going to be forever, then I, I, I can't cope with that. Um, so anyway, I'm going to review it. But with the spoons of energy thing, yeah, it's literally how many spoons have you got? And at the moment, I'm in minus spoons. <laughs> and it's frustrating. I don't know about any of you that have chronic illness, but I find it really frustrating if I have to just sit on the sofa and watch YouTube or videos or telly or something or do something on the lap. I just find it frustrating. I'm like, I want to be able to do things because oh, this door is driving me insane. My mind is going 20 to the dozen, you know. And before I got ill, I was such an active person, such an active person. So to come down from that is really hard. And to go minus spoons is even harder. So anyway, that's my fibro section this week. <laughs> and I'm hoping my spoonage will improve. <laughs> but if it doesn't, then obviously I'm going to have to go back to two again. And we're she's going to have to refer me to be tested for the fits. So we'll just have to wait and see how it all goes. And watch this space. And I'll keep you posted, if you like. This door, honestly... It needs a bit of WD-40, I think, or something, but it's very squeaky. Um, so, yeah, that's today. Tomorrow, I am going... I'm trying to hold it. <laughs> Tomorrow, I'm going to back to my counsellor, Kids Inspire. So, when I first got ill, I went to see them with the girls because the girls needed to be treated too because they couldn't cope with the fact that I'd changed so much, so drastically. Um, and I was treated as well and if I hadn't have been treated I can quite honestly put my hands up and say I wouldn't be here no nah. I didn't think my life was worth anything then I have a completely different outlook now but I have been struggling lately I have and I'm putting my hands up to that I have been struggling and I don't want to go on antidepressants or anything like that because of weight gain and because it's more tablets so basically I th reached out to my counsellor and said can I come and see you because I'm feeling really low and she was like yeah of course so I'm seeing her tomorrow um, and we're going to sort of just have a chat and see where we are and like I said on Twitter I see it as a strength to ask for help not a weakness so if you ever ever need help you ask because that's a sign of strength okay and that's what I'm doing tomorrow I'm not looking forward to it Looking forward to seeing my counsellor again because we got on quite well. But I'm not looking forward to getting upset, which I know I will do. Um, and it drains me even more. And being on minus spoonage, it's going to really drain me, isn't it? Eve, shower. This way. Good girl. In you go. Not a shower because you're a bit smelly. That's it. In you go. It's your favourite thing, isn't it? Make sure you don't know what you need to do your head because you're getting sick of it here.
Hey, you go to the bathroom. Yeah. Where's she gone? Where's she gone? There she is. <laughs> that nice? Was it nice? <laughs> she always does this after a shower, don't you? That was uh, Evie having a shower because she did this this morning. She was sick on my sofa, so I had to wash the cover, and she was a bit smelly. And she, the vets told us to give her a shower anyway after the infection she's had. So that's done. Shut it down. So today I've been to, it's Friday by the way, Friday, Friday, Friday. Oh, I've been for my counselling and I just cried. <laughs> I just sat there and cried. I did talk to her as well. And she's recommending that I'm going to start art therapy. So it's actually what Poppy did when she had her counselling, but I won't be drawing superheroes. <laughs> um, so I think I start that next Thursday and I'm going to do that once a week. So that should be good and hopefully that will help because I need to get my mind in a better position really. Um, so now I'm just going to have my lunch and I'm going to chill out because I'm absolutely whacked from the counselling and from sharing the dog. And I hope you've enjoyed this week's vlog. Thank you for all your support on Poppy's um, concert that she did, the charity gig. And if you haven't seen it already, I will link it and you go and check it out. She's brilliant in it as usual. And um, yeah, do the usual garb subscribe if you're not already hit that thumbs up because a lot of you are forgetting uh, <laughs> leave me a nice comment and i'll see you next week bye